Hello everyone, Tom Plays Games. I'm back with another video. Today we're going to be playing more Tabs Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. So the developers of Tabs have added two new factions, Good and Evil. I can't wait to see what these do. So the first one is called the Devil Gauntlet, which is like some... I don't really know, they look a bit like priests with very bright shiny gauntlets. Okay, I'm going to make them fight a few headbutters. So they're pretty decent, but they're still the weak. They're still the weakest one in the good faction. How about Celestial Aegis? Oh my gosh, they look amazing. Let's make them fight a few harpoons. <laughs> Imagine yeah. That's interesting. <laughs> what? Radiant Glaive? Oh my gosh, yes please. What the hell? Okay, take them out. He's literally shooting you oh even though he's all the way up there. Because he's dead. <laughs> so we also have this thing called the Righteous Paladin, which is like a guy with a hammer and shield. Okay. Let's make them fight about, let's say, 50 peasants. Oh my god, what? Just ginormous hammers. What the hell? Oh, these are awesome! <laughs> yeah, they're, they're way too powerful. The Divine Arbiter? Which is a, a book, really? <laughs> what, are you gonna give us paper cuts? <laughs> okay! What? Okay, so the Divine Arbiter shoots magical explosives? Let me see more of this. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> oh, that's insane. How about I use the, one of the most tanky units in the game? The Ice Giant. Will they be able to survive? <laughs> no way! <laughs> okay, I'm really excited to see what this thing does. It's called the Sacred Elephant. <laughs> oh, that's insane! <laughs> what, what, what are you doing? You're, you're very, very excited, I see. Okay. Let's start with the OG. Mammoth versus the Sacred Elephant. I think the mammoth's gonna win. Oh, what? The sacred elephant has beaten the mammoth. Okay, now it's time for the sacred elephant to trample some poor halflings. Good luck, this team. Oh my gosh, look at them fly! <laughs> so the very final unit in the good faction is called the Chronomancer. <gasps> oh! I like the look of this one! How about let's make it fight yeah. a Monkey King it's and a couple of Samurai. <laughs> it literally just freezed the Monkey King in place. What? <laughs> it just killed the samurai in one shot, and then just obliterated the monkey king. Okay, we need to make it fight some more powerful enemies. So here I have a viking army, 
I'm going to ma make it fight a few of these. So the Valkyries are coming in for the first hit. Also, Oh, they're all going angel mode. Oh, you are not beating them. God, oh, Chromomancers are OP. Okay, Chromomancers, your final challenge defeat an ice giant. You just knocked it over. <laughs> what the hell? That poor ice giant, he doesn't stand a chance. Can I control it and get up? You just can't get up, they're hitting you so much but you just can't. So now I've looked at the good faction, let's look at the evil faction. So here we have Shadow Walkers. Which are like, they kind of got like, viking helmets and bone daggers. They look cool. I like the look of these. Let's make them first a couple of cacti. Oh, they teleport! Yeah, but they know the chance for the cacti. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, you, you can't beat a cacti. The Exiled Sentinel. So here we have the Exiled Sentinel. Oh my god! They look a little bit like cacti. Look at that, they look exactly the same. Okay, true test of strength. Are you better than the cacti? If if these exiled sentries are better than the cacti, I'll change my profile picture to these. <laughs> it looks like a pretty even match here. Oh, another one's dead. Oh, I think the Exiled Sentries are gonna win! The Exiled Sentries win! That does it. New profile picture. It's gonna be the Exiled Sentries. Okay, next up, we have the Mad Mechanic. Uh... That's... Interesting. <laughs> Let's see how you do against some sword casters. N not very well, okay. How about against some. Oh, okay. Some clubbers. What? He <laughs> like has blue fire flamethrowers. One black beard versus, let's say, 15 mad mechanics. Oh, 
okay, it's, it's not good enough to do that though. One, but no. Ten Void Cultists versus fifty Squires. Okay, ten Void Cultists. Wait, ten Void Cultists versus. 50 squires. Who will win? Wow, we just demolished them with like lasers? What? Oh my gosh! They're really good. And <laughs> just one little squire. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you're dead. So one Tempest Lich. Let's make a fight a Minotaur. Wow. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. So I haven't made them fight any good units yet. So how about let's make it fight five righteous paladins. Oh, you're about to die. Oh! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> you just got five hammers in the face. Now it's dead. Okay, for the final unit of evil, the Void Monarch. That is a lot of bones! Okay. How will you do against a pirate captain? Two cannons. Two harpooners. Four bomb throwers. And four flintlocks. going on? <gasps> it's like the demon god! Well there you go. It turns into a demon. <laughs> we are going to make the good faction and the evil faction fight each other to the death. Let's start with the deviant gauntlets versus Shadow Walkers. Who will win? Oh, the Shadow Walkers teleport behind. Oh, but they're no match. As they always say, good beats evil. Next up, 
the celestial address. I, I still don't know how to pronounce that. Versus the exiled sentries. Now, as soon as these are these are less expensive than these. Like, Okay, next up, the Celestial Aegis versus Exile Sentries. Go. Oh, blasting magical orbs at them. Oh no, they got too much armor. Oh, they're all going down. Yes. The Radiant Glaives. Versus the Mad Mechanics. Oh! Each one took a glaive to the face. And now we just came flame through to death. Good as one! Round four, the Righteous Paladins. Let's get ten of those in. Versus... Ten of Void Cultists. Go. You have swords on this end, you have hammers on this end, it's just absolute mayhem. on the floor. Oh, but they're just getting absolutely clobbered. Oh, evil team's one on this side. The good team is outnumbered. again next up divine artaba five of these versus five tempest liches am i saying that right <laughs> Team has won. Next, the sacred elephants versus the Deathbringers. I love these. These are really cool designs. Okay, wait, I'm gonna give them two more sacred elephants. Go! Okay, right now, let's just. just, just, just Okay, seven sacred elephants versus seven death bringers. Let's go. Oh, one's down. Two down. Three down. The sacred elephants have won. Now for the end game. Okay, now for the most powerful units in good and evil. 
the Chromomancer versus the Void Monarch. Who will win? Oh! This one's teleported. Oh, it will have to teleport to get to open. The red team has won! Oh my gosh! That was awesome! No, oh, but it's not over yet. Wow, this is making my computer lag a lot. It seems this one here is returning angel mode. <laughs> okay, I think I might have broken the game. So everyone has turned into either an angel or a demon. It's just utter chaos. But it seems that the good team's actually winning. Oh, did not mean to do that. Good team has won! And now, for the grand finale, we're gonna make the good team and the evil team fight each other out. We're gonna make a huge army of a hundred units. And here we go. A team of 100 and 100. This is going to be utter mayhem. Giant hammers in the sky. A lot of giant hammers in the sky. Flying knives everywhere. Magical explosives coming out of books. It's complete and utter chaos. team has won! Thanks for watching my video everyone, I really hope you enjoyed the video and see you next time!